Hey guys, you're Marty Geek. In this video, I am playing Lego Marvel Super Heroes 2 on the Nintendo Switch. Yes, sir. So here I am showing you that I'm actually on the Nintendo Switch. And uh, this is the physical game, but it does occupy some more space if you're, for example, downloading uh, like the DLCs available, like 1.2 gigabytes of storage that you need. Uh, but that's if you're going to be downloading the DLCs because this week I actually downloaded the DLC for Thanos, uh, which I made a video the other day thanks to Warner Brothers for, you know, giving me the... Um, they actually sent me this physical game um, and um, the uh, another care package with uh, other things as well, which I already did a video for you guys. I hope you actually watch that video. But one thing that I actually noticed, I'm loading here the game, which like you see there, I'm barely starting this game. I'm around 6.8 gigabytes when it comes in store to progress, which is insane because I actually thought I have played a lot more of this game than 6.8 percentage of playthrough that's insane um so right now i'm gonna be playing this game for a while because i actually want to finish it especially since i already um, saw the movie um avengers infinity wars uh which was was amazing i loved it i really loved it and i can't wait to watch it again but right here i just want to show you guys you know thanks to the dlc that came out this week i want to show you guys how you can change um, to the, for example, the Thanos. I'm gonna go ahead and change to Thanos. Just press and hold the X button, and right here in the bottom, right here in the bottom, we get the new characters that we have unlocked, um, based on the DLC that you have downloaded. So I got Thanos here. There you go. So I got this guy is gonna turn into Thanos. Awesome. Look at that. And let me go ahead and change Groot. It's gonna change Groot. Okay, now Groot, when I press the X, it actually shrinks him down, <laughs> which is going to be, okay, there you go. So right here, we're going to go ahead and switch to the new suit for Iron Man. This is the Hulkbuster Mark II. Uh, this suit actually came out in the Avengers movie. This is the one, yeah, okay, I'm not going to say anything because I don't want to spoil you anything. But this is the one that actually you can see in the trailers. So yeah, this is cool. You can play with this. You can shoot like that. What else he does is uh, he also flies. Yes, you double press the B, the B button, and he flies. And while you're flying, you can actually shoot around. So we got to go to that target right there. But right now we can change here because this is basically like uh, the hub, like the open world section of the game. And look at that. With Thanos, we can actually fly, but he turns... You know, he brings the chair. <laughs> that is awesome. So here with the A, he like... Okay, look at that. His attacks are very powerful. Very powerful. You can see there. And his slam is just awesome as well. Look at that. You see the Infinity Stones. He has the gauntlet. And the awesome chair, which looks incredible. <laughs> I think it looks awesome. So this, I really didn't discover this earlier when I started playing the DLC for Thanos. I never, I never did this. I never um, flew with the chair. I finished the DLC. Uh, for those asking, the DLC is not that long at all. It's just one level. I don't know if I'm missing anything, but for me, it just took me one level. I finished it. And after that, you can replay the missions again with other characters. So if you want to play instead of with Proxima Midnight, you want to bring um, other characters like Iron Man and all that. Yes, you can do that. Um, but other than that, it's really short. And then I downloaded another DLC, which was for the heroes. Um, it's the kids. What's the one The one that came out in the show? The Runaways. Yeah, the Runaways. I downloaded the Runaways show DLC, and the same thing. It's one episode. Uh, you do. It's one mission. It's one level. You do the mission, and you're done. You play with every single character. You unlock every single character as well. Even the dinosaur. I think you actually d unlock the dinosaur. There you go. So. Boom. 
So of course, like I said, I decided to upload this video now as well because not only the movie came out this week, but I just realized that I never did upload a video in TV mode for this game. Yeah, I thought I did, but I actually didn't. I, I started searching in my video playlist and I, I can't find my TV mode video that I recorded for this game. I think I never did. Where I never uploaded it, I don't know, but I thought I actually did. So, sorry for you guys. I think I did receive a whole bunch of messages asking me, Hey, can you please record this game in TV mode so we can see how it actually looks? Because the first video that I uploaded was in portable mode, like I like to record. But... There you go. Enlisted in Kang's army for the rest of your existence. Absolutely free. So Iron Man looks badass. The Hulkbuster M Mark II suit looks looks really really good. Looks really really good. So right here, I think there's something. Dang it! What a man! <laughs> here we can use. There's something here for Iron Man, but I guess I can't be on the freaking suit. See, there's something there that requires Iron Man, but I don't think I can use the suit, the mark, the big suit. So I'm going to go ahead here and start a mission, a story mission. But of course, the story mission, you cannot play with Thanos or the new suit for Iron Man because... Let's go ahead and load it. Okay, there you go. I cut the loading screen. There was a loading screen with J Jonah Jameson, I think it was. He's like um, doing like a briefing. What's going on in this world? If you played this game, you know what I'm talking about. Then we start this mission right here with uh, Star Lord getting <laughs> trying to cheat somebody in the bet. Uh oh, you trying to cheat a pig? <laughs> Boy. <laughs> okay, Gamora to the rescue. You two are supposed to be taking readings. Oh, yeah. I totally was. But then Drax found this place. It had music. <laughs> it had music. It had beers and <sighs> tacos. We have to find a negative <laughs> I don't know. Drax doesn't look that good. Get out there and start searching. How does it work? See that blinky light? If it don't flash, you don't have it. If it does... Your blinky light lies. I do not have it. Outlaw! <laughs> <laughs> that? that, my fuzzy friend, is our power source. I am Mordok. The ultimate the human machine. machine. The law. Well, not in my town. Isn't that? Don't ask. This place gets <laughs> Bring it. Okay, so we gotta defeat this sucker. Okay, so this is a mess here. There's a lot of characters on the screen. Um, <laughs> what's cool in this game, too, like this right here, you can tag team with your partner, with another Lego partner, and do like an incredible freaking move. Um, that's something that was not available, if I'm not mistaken. I'm pretty sure it was not available in the first superhero game that I played last year. Not last year, like came out like three years ago, two years ago. Okay, this guy has a force field or what? Can't seem to figure this out. Okay, it's gonna Fight like that. It's gonna assemble this. Dun, 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 dun. Aha! That electric gizmo looks right up my street. <laughs> Here we need Rocket Raccoon. So I think we use. I think we actually use the Y. Is it the Y now? You press the A and hold. Okay. There you go, it's charging that until this thing starts, what, this is like a, one of those music box. <laughs> well, it is playing some music, but right now I have the music turned off because of, um, you know, copyright issues. But there is some music going on right there. <laughs> I guess it's to drive him crazy. <laughs> Okay, there you go. Boom, boom, boom. 
and press the A. Oh yeah, boy. Dun dun. <laughs> oh crap. What the hell? Okay, he didn't kill me. What the hell did he kill? I thought he killed somebody. I thought he killed me. Okay, this guy just left to the other side. Boom, boy. There you go. Right here. Boom. We're attacking him with a um, raccoon. Kick some ass, raccoon. There you go, little rabbit. <laughs> Oh man, uh oh, uh oh. Oh man, I got killed here again. Don't worry, at least this is Lego game. Which the great thing about Lego games is that you come back really fast. No difference in this game. There you go, boom, boom, bam. Okay, that took a little bit of health away. He's going to still use that freaking laser thing, which is really powerful. Oh. Oh. Ah, uh, no, I can't lock. No, crap, I can't lock to him. I guess the furniture, the stairs thing. There you go. Do -do 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 -do. Ooh, that was a nice tag team move right there. But the problem with this game is that those tag team moves a lot of times don't work out great because it's you use the X and when you use the X to do the tag team move instead of doing the freaking tag team move you actually switch characters which is the same button that you use to switch characters so it sucks since it should have used like a shoulder button or something like that to do the tag team move because oh, there you go come on here you go Eh, eh, with Gamora. But don't worry, my little friends will help keep you entertained. What? Where you going? Okay, we got this. Hmm. Man, there's a mess right here. I don't even see my character. <laughs> There you go. We, I know we switched there. There you go. There you go. Ooh. Another tag team move? No. I, did I? No, we switch again. See what I'm saying? I try to do these tag team moves and I just end up switching characters. So right here, we're going to have to... Okay, something over here. I think I need Raccoon. Dude, get the hell out of my way. Okay, it says uh, Lego object hold Y to target or A to throw a grenade. So I got to throw a grenade to what? Okay. I like Rocket Raccoon. Rocket Raccoon has very cool moves. You see there? Ah, I got, got killed again, but come on. Respawn. <laughs> okay, there you go. He's like a grenade. He throws like a grenade with the A button. But where are we supposed to throw that grenade? Okay, we got something there. Oh, we got killed again. Okay. Oh, there you go. For those boxes. Okay. Let's go try another one for that one. Boom. There you go. What's this? What is this? Cactus? What? I'm getting my ass killed for this cactus? I thought it was to open something, you know? Okay, well, am I supposed to... Okay. Oop, press the freaking button again. I accidentally keep pressing the L, the left stick. 
And every time you press the last stick, it gives you like a little um, hint. Ooh, there you go. There you go. We got to put this thing together. There you go. What else? We're gonna light it up. <laughs> now you're really mad, huh? <laughs> oh no. Oh, okay, just a little bit there. Come on. Oh, oh, no. Oh. Oh, what is this? Okay, there's something here. Press the A. Okay. Why? Oh, crap. I didn't get it together. Okay. Turn the stick. Y. B. Okay, this is sequin buttons. You gotta do some sequins to here. You got Y. B. Y. A. Oh, look at this. It's like a cowboy mechanical Iron Man. <laughs> Oh yeah. What well, what was the purpose for that? I don't know. It was to get one of these hidden stuff. <laughs> I don't know what was that for, but I guess it was to get some like one of those hidden blocks or things that you have to capture. Okay, this guy's taking too long to beat. We got to beat this guy already. Come on. There you go. <laughs> oh, wait a second. There's another... Man, get the hell out of my way. Where the hell these people keep on coming from? <laughs> there you go. This guy takes a lot of damage. Get away from me, you <laughs> You're freaking little creature. Come over here. Come over here. Boom. So I gotta say, the game looks really good here on the Nintendo Switch. And... There was a couple updates available when I first installed this game after a, a, a lot of a lot of months that I didn't play this game. Um, it did download. I don't know what version is it right now. I think it's in version 1.6. I think it is. Um, and I think from the first time that I actually played this game, the improvements in the frame rate has truly, truly improved. So like you see here in this video, it looks really good pretty strong okay i need rocket raccoon over here again oh my god this guy's shooting a uh, freaking laser over here <laughs> so like you notice on the screen the the frame rate is way better than before because i did go back and watch my vi my first video that i recorded and and i do remember that another reason i didn't keep playing this game and I turned it back in. First, I was I was busy playing another game, and two, I didn't like too much the frame rate. The frame rates I didn't like too much, and I was like, ah oh, man, this is not a really good port. I had some problems here, but uh, in my opinion, after playing it now, after so months months without playing it, it feels really nice, really smooth. The graphics feel looks really awesome, just like you would see on PlayStation 4, and you know, and I'm saying the same resolution, but it looks really damn good. We need Drax here. Drax, get over here. Boom. 
What are we doing here? Why? Okay. That's it? Just to smash the floor? That's it? Okay, we need Gamora. Come over here. We need to slide him up. Okay, I think we need to reflect his laser to him. Do it again. Do it again. Come over here. There you go. I know this because we already do this type of attacks in different other levels. Like you reflect the lasers back to them. Oh, I think we got him. Curse you! My doomsday chair! Ha 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 ha. Okay, I can't hit him like that because he has a force field. I think we got him on our ropes, partners. But we can't get close to him unless. What's that on the balcony above him? Oh, over here. What's that? Push, push, push! There you go. Nice. Uh oh. <laughs> Here comes the chickens for to the rescue. <laughs> there you go. We got a cutscene there, which I think means that this is the end of this level. I think it is. I don't know if it is or not, but the video, what I know, it's getting long. So, guys, I just want to share this gameplay with you guys. I know this game came out a long time ago, but I never did upload a video in TV mode. Uh, plus, I got to show you guys Thanos plus uh, the oh, new yeah, Iron Man Hulkbuster suit, Agreed. which looks really good. It's actually from the Avengers Infinity War movie and Thanos as well. And remember, when you download the DLC for Thanos, you also get uh, Proxima Midnight, um, Maul, the, the other guy, the I forgot his name. But you do unlock a... Th other characters as well so guys thanks for watching this video this was a hands-on look in tv mode of super heroes 2 marvels for the nintendo switch thanks for watching guys till next time we got some villains to catch we sure do kid cult <clears throat> mind if i tag along